What's going on guys? It's your boy Danny. I am here at Heatnest in Brooklyn with my friends at Secret Handshake Food Co. And we decided to come up with a little game here. Spin the wheel, you get a chance to win a free bottle of everything bagel hot sauce. But if you land on one of these numbers, you're gonna have to tell me a spicy little secret. Yeah, 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 fuck yeah! What happened to your wrist? Um, I shattered my entire thumb. <laughs> Free hot sauce, free hot sauce, free hot sauce. Oh! Spicy secret time, spicy secret time, spicy secret time. What's the weirdest place you've ever made love? In a Sears. <laughs> Inside the Sears. Inside of a Sears? In the bathroom? No. In the changing, in the changing room, but the door was open. Did he finish? <laughs> yeah. Wow. I didn't. Well, that goes without saying. <laughs> Are you still with this person? No. Do you guys ever see each other ever? No, I'm with this oh my bad what's up man what's up dude what's up? hey man listen good good for you <laughs> because you want to know something you're only going up from here have you ever spun a wheel this big before <laughs> yes hey 11. do you typically wash your hands after you use the bathroom in your own home Yes, but the butt is at night. If it's in the middle of the night, you wash your butt at night. No, I'm, I don't. If I'm going to the bathroom in the middle of the night, I'm just getting in, getting out. What if it's number two? That's concerning. If you have to shit in the middle of the night. But isn't that amazing that the human body will wake you up to shit? I've never had that problem. Oh, I have <laughs> many times. I like your jacket. Oh, thanks. Wow. Free bottle! Yeah! Yeah! Fuck yeah! Secret Handshake Food Co. Everything bagel hot sauce you want, yeah! Another free bottle. Go get it, Greg. Go get the bottle, Greg! Oh my god, this fucking mustache is outrageous. Do you think people are creeped out by your stash? I'm not. I would say men know women a little bit. <laughs> All right. Here's a guy cosplaying as me. Uh, fucking Comic Con out here. When was the last time you cried, and why did you cry? It was watching. Coco. You're Hispanic, right? Yes. So Coco hits different when you're Hispanic, obviously. Well, actually, I lied. It's not Coco. It's uh, In the Heights. In the Heights, super yes. Hispanic. So only Hispanic <laughs> singing movies make you cry. Yeah, and it has to do with a grandmother, like, oh, dying. Okay. okay. Yeah. Yeah, damn. All right. Well, we got one of the members of the Outsiders here. When did you decide to go full leather? I'm a, I'm a metal guy growing up, so I think it just happened. We got to get your parents out here. Uh, uh, they're both dead, but it's all right. <laughs> yeah, free bottle, free bottle, free bottle. I want to do a secret. Yeah, no, nah, it's free bottle. All right. But all right, man, go ahead. You win your free bottle of everything flavored hot sauce by our friends at Secret Handshake Food Co. Joan Greg. How are your parents doing today? Oh, uh, my mom is cool. My dad is dead. Damn it! Where's everyone's parents? When's the last time you lied to make somebody feel good about themselves? I do that shit all the time, dude. <laughs> I hype the homies up all the time, but sometimes I'm like, yo, you gotta, we gotta get you out of sweatpants. Gotta get you into some sort of like structured pant. You know what I'm saying? Something you can iron. You smell great. You, you know what I'm saying? You There's smell like good. A... My parents are both alive and well. Yes! Not, so. I didn't mean it. I didn't mean it like that. Sorry. We interviewed your girlfriend before. She, she, she was a Sears girl. Sears girl took your virginity. Oh, wow. You took his virginity? Not all right, get over here. Get over here. So you went on a sexual conquest through Sears to take his virginity. How was his performance i was surprised <laughs> fuck yeah dude <laughs> yo, my, yo my man joe fox dude that's fire dude good for you i know you're slinging heat too all right post malone over here love that fucking shirt look at that fat bastard still fat number four if you could wipe any animal off the face of the earth make them extinct what would it be? I mean, I feel like I gotta go spiders just because I'm sick and tired of hearing my girlfriend scream about them in her bedroom. I hate I hate when people are like, oh, don't kill those ones. Those are good spiders. <laughs> and then I also hate like when like people will be like, hey, like, uh, you know, just catch it and release it. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, that's my girlfriend. But then like sometimes they'll be like, oh, like, come on, like, they, they, they have families and a spider family to go to. Fuck that spider's family. You know what I'm saying? If I gotta listen to you- And that's like the whole time for me, like- You look great tonight. <laughs> Thank you. You look absolutely amazing. Where are you from? Manchester. Manchester. Man City or Man U? Man City. I'm, fr I'm from Whitby. <laughs> All right. When I was in London, I got me some Nando's. He did. Yeah. It's not bad, it's not bad. It's just very stereotypical. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> All right, whatever. If you had to wipe any animal off the face of the earth, what would it be? Um, would it be foxes? 
No. Cats. <laughs> I hate Whoa. cats. <laughs> Why do you hate cats so much? They're just awful. They look like they're kind of sent here from, from hell. Yeah, definitely. Yeah, they'll, definitely. they'll switch and decide to kill you. Yeah, yeah. definitely. Uh, wasps. Cats. Wasps are dicks. <laughs> wasps are dicks. Looks like Macaulay Culkin. Um, get that all the time, yeah. You get that all the time? Yep. Have you ever eaten a booger? I can't say I have. Everyone's eating a booger, right? Everyone here has eaten one of their bugs, right? Everyone's eating a booger, right? You gotta eat boogers in the streets. All right. What is your biggest regret in life? I don't have regret. Oh, jeez. All right, get out of here. What's your dream guy? I want to hear your dream guy. Go. All right. You can hear my dream guy. A dream guy is someone who's adventurous, someone who um, allows me to experience the world, takes me to travel. Um, what else? Okay, I'm cut you off. <laughs> That's a rich man. Are you guys dating? Uh, engaged. We are engaged. Oh, excuse me. <laughs> Shouldn't we get rings? Yeah, I said that the, the minute I put it on, I'm like, I feel naked the whole time. What a crock of shit. Was there someone that you wanted to invite to your wedding that she said no to? I had a few friends that he gave me a hard no to. But I were they dudes? <laughs> they were dudes. There was one dude. But I'm just, <laughs> I'm just friends with everyone, so I want to invite everyone I've ever met. I'm joined by my friend here who's pretty nervous and doesn't want to be here right now, but I made her come up here. All right, number one. Oh! But I'm still going to ask you a question if that's okay. All right. What was the worst thing about your ex? Any ex? Um, he was a ginger. Oh my gosh, he said he was a ginger. All right. No, he was a serial cheater. Oh, yeah. a, and, he, and ginger. That's even worse. <laughs> yeah. If you had to say anything to them right now, what would you say? Um, I hope you're having fun raising your child. <laughs> Fucking little ginger baby. Fuck that kid, dude. <laughs> that kid's trash. Okay. You're not really good with hot sauce? Oh, that stinks because you won one. <laughs> you ever got cooties? Nope. Do girls got cooties? <laughs> First of all, I gotta ask, how tall are you? Yeah, you know, six five, six six. What's it like? Oh, it's great. <laughs> Isn't it so awesome? Yeah, it's it's kind of the best. The worst the worst thing about being five nine is when you walk into a bar, no woman looks at you. Yeah. What's your favorite thing? Favorite thing? Yeah, just fucking favorite thing in the world. Just generally? Yeah. The Basement Yard podcast. Okay, that's a good one. Go. What about the other one? Favorite uh, besides that, maybe like John Adams. Like John Adams. John Adams I have no idea who that is. Oh. <laughs> this guy has been staring at me for about 25 minutes, trying to just figure out the wheel. All right, you want a free bottle from that spin of the wheel that you just did? I swear to God. That was All right, yeah, you cheated. I'm Brianna. Brianna, this is. Greg's wife's sister. I'm sure you have enough of this hot sauce. Yeah, free bottle. You got to give it up. This guy gives no discounts. He's the worst. This guy's like, hey, man, you want my book? Buy it. I'm like, come on. <laughs> Who would win in a fight, you or your sister? Post baby, my sister. Pre baby, you're fucking her up. Yeah. <laughs> What's the, your least favorite thing about Greg? He does love the tea. He likes to s stir the pot a little bit. Greg Dieback, everybody. <laughs> what a one of the co-owners co of, of this fine hot sauce. Are you into stirring the tea? Yes. Let me ask you a question. When you're doing other people's lives, do you ever worry about what your wife thinks of your show? No, I'm more worried about what my daughter is going to think when she discovers it one day. I know. You, you tell me. Okay, so what's your biggest regret in life? I did sell Amazon somewhere around 1999. Yeah, I know. All right, guys, let's go. <laughs> we're going to start our own book company, and we're going to stick it to Jeff. There you fuck go. Fuck that guy. Yeah. Fuck Jeff. Hey, fuck you, Jeff Bezos. <laughs> Who is the sexiest cartoon character of all time? Oh, my God. Hands down, the fish from Finding Nemo. Yeah, which one? The one with the scar, like the black and white one. <laughs> this is the first time that anyone has ever said... Anybody from Finding Nemo is hot. Yeah. She wants to have sex with a fish, y'all. We had a lot of fun. Gave out some uh, everything bagel hot sauce that you can go and get yourself right now. It's secrethandshake.shop. Uh, go get yourself a bottle. Uh, thank you to everyone. Thank you guys for coming out. Had a great time. You guys are all weirdos, and I'm a weirdo too. Like and subscribe, and we'll see you next time. Peace.